You guys might have noticed that in TI-10, there is a build that is completely taking over right now with Earthshaker. And I'm going to give you a quick breakdown before I give you a couple highlights here. So the first thing is, what it revolves around is quite simple. The idea of using Enchant Totem and its bonus attack based damage, in addition to Fey Grenade, which for some reason a lot of people don't actually read what it does, but one of the things it does is that it actually deals your attack damage. What's unique about Fey Grenade is like, watch, so if I throw it out here, okay, it does about 200 damage. All right, that's fine. But if I utilize Enchant Totem, it's going to amplify my next attack by 400%. The result of that is that the actual Fey Grenade does 600 damage, and then you also get to right click as well for the bonus, which is absolutely obscene. So you're doing a tremendous amount of damage. Now there's a couple things you guys need to be aware of, first of all, with regard to this, okay? The Fey Grenade does not utilize the bonuses of Daedalus or Silver's Edge, okay? So that's why I included them here. Just so you guys can see the fact that they don't actually gain any benefit to the Fey Grenade, although they obviously do benefit your auto attack. It's also important to understand that if you auto attack first and then use Fey Grenade, you don't get the bonus damage. You actually have to Fey Grenade first and the Enchant Totem remains active and then you right click. That is the um, the kind of the progression that you're supposed to use in order to maximize the Fey Grenade damage. It's absolutely insane. It's being used on position three, uh, Earthshaker specifically. It's also being used on position four, Earthshaker, because it's just beneficial as well. And once you start getting some stat items and your attack damage goes up, you're gonna see a tremendous amount of burst like I'm gonna show you in these examples. In this example from TI-10, what we've got here is we got JT from Invictus. He's coming in on FNG. Now I want you just to note the amount of damage that FNG takes. We'll do it in hyper slow motion here. You'll notice that he has the Enchant Totem active. He has the Fey Grenade. Look at this Fey Grenade and how hard it hits FNG for. 800 health down to just under 300 and he basically just explodes. Okay, that was just the Fey Grenade. 600 damage just from the Fey Grenade and um, it's truly remarkable the amount of damage you can do. He literally just got deleted. So in the same game here, you have the position for Hodskin uh, MK here. Now, he's not as tanky as the core MK, but what you're going to see is he's getting pinged out by none other than our Earthshaker. So our Earthshaker wants to initiate on top of this MK. And what you're going to see here is, once again, the combo of Enchant Totem with Fey Grenade. Watch how fast this MK explodes. So you're getting the initiation with the Aghanim Scepter. Okay, you get the Fey Grenade right here. There's the Fey Grenade. Half his health is gone. The right click, and then he's just dead. Okay, the amount of damage is just absolutely insane. If you still don't believe me, check this out. So we have a position three Earthshaker going up against Mumiander's position four um, Phoenix. Now the key thing to understand about Phoenix, pretty tanky as a support, 1900 HP right now, has the Glimmer Cape and a Holy Locket as well. Watch how fast Mumiander explodes here, thanks to the Fey Grenade and the right click. So you have the initial initiation, you have the Fey Grenade, you have the right click, and dead absolutely insane amount of burst damage it's truly ridiculous and it doesn't stop there if you need more evidence as to how broken this build is check this smoke out okay so ku's coming in with the team okay dubu setting up behind the trees in a very safe position this is like an ideal position but it, well let's see what's going to happen here so ku's going to uh going to initiate here in a moment and once again you have the fey grenade with the enchant totem uh, combination also has the shadow blade as well watch this absolute destruction so you get the fissure you get the blink the fey grenade and a right click dubu literally explodes never stood a chance this build is absolutely insane right now. It's going to get nerfed. Ice Frog's looking at this right now, be like, well, we, we missed this one for TI, boys. We'll get it right after. And you know what? If you're into uh, other broken builds, definitely take a look at the next video that I have queued up for you. And thank you so much for watching. And a very special thank you to all of our wonderful subscribers. We will see you in the next video.